it's Whitney and it's Wonder Wednesday. Today, something for your hips. Sit off to one side and lean onto your hand. Put your other hand on your hip. As you inhale and exhale, rotate your hip up and then back down. Just really simple like this. It might be a big movement or it might not be a big movement. At some point, for me, it's when the hip comes down, um, I start to feel a lot of tension in there. So as you're moving your body, as you're doing this, really pay attention and listen to where your own boundaries are. So I'm just going to keep my knee down and move from here to here, and then switch sides. Um, I like to keep my ankles flexed like this because it keeps it more active. But if you would prefer to keep your whole legs relaxed, you can also do that. Just play with, see which one feels better. So steadily breathing as you press your hip back and forward. Again, you could lift your knee up like this. Getting in your body is a way of creating connection in the world. It starts at home. This move is a remedy for if you're sitting a lot, if you are driving a lot, if you have a lot of not movement, even if you're walking a lot. It's a nice way to move through your hip joints in a gentle way. As always, I'm offering you movement, these small simple movements in your body so that you can be more present here so that you can be more present out there. How are we in our bodies and in the world? And how can these little things help us be, um, I don't know. <laughs> how can these little things done every day help make the world a better place? Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.